This is quite a turnabout in events. Do you think, therefore, it adds perhaps value to the Hyperloop focus and that some of the startups that are already ploughing the furrows there are going to get a boost or, or a hindrance from this? Well, obviously, anybody who's involved with Hyperloop has already gotten a huge boost out of Elon Musk's initial idea and promotion of the idea and his, you know, reflective glow. He is an astonishing person to have in your community. Now, if if he do go, goes directly a competitive with your company, that's another matter. It's very hard to know exactly what's happening because the you know the the article and the speculation is somewhat based on um, indirect evidence, statements coming off of uh, of SpaceX's website that used to say they wouldn't go into this business, for example. Uh, then you have also the fact that Elon Musk has got the Boring Company, which funny name, but is intended to, it was said to be a, to build roads underneath L.A. or underneath cities to aid in traffic management, but in fact may be building systems to build Hyperloop tubes underground. So he is one of the great thinkers of all history. I, I think you could think of him as almost a Thomas Edison for our day. So you wouldn't want to be competing with him, but on the other hand, you would want him talking about what you do. So if you're a company already in the Hyperloop business, it's sort of a yin and a yang situation.